study of the book of Exodus, we're in chapter 32, verse 6. Moses is up getting the instructions about the Ten Commandments. He's ready to come down with those. The people have said, look, Moses is missing. You, Aaron, make us a gold calf, just in case we want to go back to Egypt. You know, we want to lead with the golden calf as we come in. So now they've done it, and they declared, well, let's read verse 6. So the next day they rose early and offered burnt offerings and brought peace offerings, and the people sat down to eat and to drink and rose up to play. So they made the golden calf. They got everything together. They declared the next day would be a religious day of observance. And they got up early that day and they began having this big party. This is not the way God does things. This is a syncretistic thing. Notice they have burnt offerings and peace offerings. That's part of the faith of Israel. But they're blending them with this worship of the golden calf, which like in the in commandment number two, 10 commandments, there's 10. Number two said, you know, don't worship any idols. And they're in, in, in immediately they're breaking that commandment just instantly. Uh, and they're prone toward idolatry. That's perhaps why it's number two in the list. God is like, you know, no gods before me. And let's be particular here, no idols. Well, here they are. They're lost their mind and they're doing the idol thing right right now, right on the foot at the foot of the mountain where God's up on top of the mountain. But uh, that's what you have here. And you have this as, a, this is, you know, we kind of think these people were, were out of their minds. But today we do, the, very often Christians do the same thing. Isn't it true? Am I telling you the truth? We blend the, the commandments of men with the commandments of God. We begin doing it man's way instead of God's way. And we keep some of God's pieces, you know, and so it's called syncretism. It's like putting two things together that don't match. They can't go together. You're putting the oil and the water together and you're blending it and you're declaring, oh, that's blended. That's all one piece, but it's not blending. It cannot blend. What right? What fellowship hath righteousness with unrighteousness, with light, with darkness? What fellowship do they have? So here we have uh, this very thing is happening. This fake religion is being brought in sideways, brought into the religion of Israel. And the, what you have is a gooey, uh, awful, non-sin removing mess. And so that wasn't just a problem for them all the way back here in the time of the Exodus. That's a problem for us today in the 2020s. All right, see you tomorrow morning, and we'll carry on further yet.